While we were very busy last year, we got a lot more on the way. Let's take a look at some uh, of what's in store for 2019. Since 2000, our Madison County population has grown 30%, adding 85,000 people. There's a steady stream of groundbreakings and expansions. We're truly blessed. Our job is to provide efficient county services to a growing population. But our courthouse is 52 years old, older than the 50th anniversary of landing on the moon that we'll celebrate this year. Houston, uh, Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. Well, Dale, what I'd really like to do is have an open concept. We take some columns out. Now, if this was a remodeling show, in one weekend, we could transform the courthouse with a gallon of paint and a few swings of the sledgehammer. This is amazing. I love the open concept. Beautiful. What we're really going to do is open the Madison County Services Center in 2020 at the corner of Oakwood Avenue and Memorial Parkway the probate office, the license department, tax assessor, tax collector, and sales tax department will all move there. It's centrally located, and best of all, lots of free parking. That will free up space we need in the courthouse for courtrooms, judges, and the district attorney. On a similar note, there's been approval for a new federal courthouse in downtown Huntsville. They've been in the same building since 1932. The largest employer for Madison County and the 13 surrounding counties is Redstone Arsenal. The Arsenal is home to the FBI's Terrorist Explosive Device Analytical Center. Fire in the hole! In 2018, they opened the Tennessee Valley Regional Computer Forensics Laboratory. These facilities are designed to quickly analyze threats to our national security. More than ever, Madison County needs a highly skilled workforce. Our colleges are stepping up. UAH will reach 10,000 students for the first time. Hands-on labs and internships are common for students at UAH, Alabama A&M University, Oakwood University, Drake State, and Calhoun Community College. In one example, Calhoun and Huntsville built a new nursing simulation lab. The demand for skilled nurses is growing fast. Huntsville Hospital plans to add 72 private beds. There will be a new patient tower building on the main campus. Huntsville Hospital is the only level one trauma center in this part of the state, and it's the largest emergency department in the state of Alabama. Adding the patient tower will let them move patients more quickly from the emergency department to private rooms. Crestwood Medical Center received a national quality award for their high level of care for stroke patients. Wherever you see construction, that's a sure sign that people and companies see our community as a place to grow. You see it along I-565 where Town Madison is taking shape. The Trash Pandas will play their first minor league baseball game in a stadium that will be built right here in 2020. After a citywide vote, the owners of a minor league baseball team in Madison, Alabama announced the name of their new team and the winning name is the Rocket City Trash Pandas. <laughs> Trash Pandas. It's a kind of a great name, isn't it? Like, by the way, Trash Panda is also what my wife calls me when I get home drunk. Many car companies are now building and expanding plants in the United States. Toyota and Mazda are opening up a plant in Alabama, a big one. We're getting national attention from President Trump, James Corden, because we've got a good thing going here in Madison County. Huntsville International now has nonstop flights to 10 major cities every day. Two new carriers, Frontier and Silver Airways, have lowered ticket prices. Passenger traffic is growing by double digits. International air cargo is increasing too, with expanded coal storage for fruits, vegetables, flowers, and salmon arriving by 747 every day. 2019 will be a great year for Madison County. We'll celebrate Alabama's bicentennial at places like Constitution Hall Park. 
Did you know that we have the original bell from the second Madison County Courthouse? It was cast in Philadelphia in 1849. We're going to clean it and display it on the courthouse grounds. We'll also celebrate the 50th anniversary of landing on the moon at the U.S. Space and Rocket Center. And there's a new sheriff in town. I'm Kevin Turner, ready to be your sheriff. And the commission is ready to support you. We'll soon welcome 10 more deputies to accommodate the growth in Madison County. Thank you for your service, for keeping us safe in the greatest county in Alabama. Thank you. We always have fun with that video. It's clear we've got a really good thing going here in Madison County. It's clear we've got a great thing going here in Madison County, and 219 is set to continue our economic growth and, uh, and progress along with commercial and retail development. In closing, my job nor yours is complete. The success of our Huntsville-Madison County Chamber of Commerce that started in 1894 is alive and well 125 years later. It is my honor to report to you the 2,160 faithful members of the Huntsville-Madison County Chamber of Commerce and our business leaders that the state of Madison County, Alabama is strong, it is vibrant, it is diverse, it is profitable, it is on solid foundation, unemployment is low, and we have a high-skilled workforce. We're writing a new chapter in the history that will reap rewards for generations to come, and we can't do it without your continued support of the Huntsville-Madison County Chamber of Commerce. It is because of these reasons I truly believe Madison County's best days are still ahead. It is my greatest honor to serve you as your chairman of the Madison County Commission during these most historic times.